Harpsichords can sound really cool when they're put through all kinds of effects. In this example, I put it through an ensemble effect and also a really luscious reverb. <laughs> Of course, this is an instrument that everybody needs in their collection because you never know when you're going to need to bust out the accordion sound. I've certainly done that in a lot of my music in LTE and in Dream Theater, so I like to keep a great accordion sound on hand. This accordion is sampled using two different stops, both separately and together with the ranges extended using some very advanced DSP. So, you know, accordion only has so many notes. So in the uh, sample tank version, uh, we bust it out and we allow you to get a little further. Which I think is really, really cool. So the other thing to, uh, to note is that your pitch wheel and your mod wheel or your joystick will do the necessary kind of uh, expressive um, elements to the sound. So in this case, if I move my pitch wheel up, I'm getting a nice tremolo. And if I um, do the pitch wheel, it's not going to change the pitch, but it'll it'll give you that you know that sound of the accordion opening and closing. So between all of that. It really works. In the next example, I actually um, recorded the modulation um, information uh, on, a, on a track, and then I'm playing that back while I'm playing with two hands, because I like to play with two hands. Anyway, here it is. Prophet 5 actually has a very cool accordion sound, and we sampled that and mixed it with the real accordion. And in this blues harp, you're actually hearing those two sounds running through the sample tank effects. I think it's awesome. Here's another example. I think the harmonium is due for a major comeback. We sampled a classical Indian harmonium. We extended the range as well using DSP. And on the pitch and mod wheel, or the joystick, depending on what you're controlling, you can actually get the bellows happening. So definitely make use of those. The more expression, the better.
anyone out there ever have a melodica? You know that keyboard thing that you blow into? Well, there is a melodica as part of the alternate keys. Here it is. keyboardist doesn't have a toy piano in their collection? Well, I guess there are some, and if you don't, the alternate keys collection inside Sample Tank 4 gives you a really great toy piano. Also, what movie score have you heard, especially those ones that are haunted, doesn't have a toy piano through some amazing effect? Here you go. <laughs> 